investing channel puts together thousands of articles and videos. And unsurprisingly, we've previously relied on Shutterstock, a stock that we rate at 10 out of 10 for images. We were curious why the financial pro searched this stock 14 times more than Getty Images, according to Trackstar, a proprietary sentiment indicator. Could it have something to do with Shutterstock skyrocketing 65% and then giving back that in a few months? We did some digging and to our surprise, we found a small stock with a decent business model and a compelling valuation. As far as we knew, Shutterstock was only a stock image website. It turns out that's just scratching the surface. The company contains a comprehensive content library, including everything from videos to 3D models. And while Shutterstock isn't doubling sales every year, it's seen steady growth with no annual decline since 2015. Gross margins improved and operating margins doubled in 2020. Shutterstock holds some debt, but has twice as much cash, giving it plenty of capital for acquisitions. And what's more, it throws off plenty of cash from operations and free cash flow, which gives it a good coverage for its 2% dividend. As mentioned earlier, Shutterstock trades at a compelling valuation with low price to cash and price to sales ratios, though the PE is a bit rich. However, a good chunk of that rating is driven by share-based compensation and depreciation. While revenue growth hasn't been explosive, as at Nextdoor or Eventbrite, it's usually been in the high single digits. A profitable business model and juicy cash flow means Shutterstock has the firepower to buy growth. Plus, its 62% gross profit margin is the lowest amongst its peers, which is kind of ridiculous. We looked hard to find why Shutterstock sold off in early May and found no news event or cause. With only 23 million shares trading, the stock is bound to be volatile. Nonetheless, we like the business here and see limited downside from these prices.